it's seen its great seasons and its bad seasons. And this one, this one takes the cake. Sean Hayes is in his 10th year running Powder Ridge. He says they're getting creative with what snow they have. It's the big features. It's our terrain park. Our head groomer is very disappointed he can't deliver those big jumps. For this skier, it's still worth the trip from Westport. It's like a beautiful spring day. The conditions, the snow's a little soft, but it's great. And it's like my own private mountain. <laughs> Keeping the trails covered hasn't been easy. The warmth constantly, and more importantly, that rain to go along with the warm temperatures has been the significant challenge this year. Years ago, it would have been impossible to ski in a winter like this one. But thanks to the investments in snowmaking, on a sunny 60 degree day, the mountain's still running. In a given 12 hour period at night, we can blanket all of our main trails in a single night. The snow guns haven't pulled many all nighters this winter. We need 28 degree wet bulb. That is a combination of temperature and humidity. So it's about, you know, that 28 mark, we can make some snow. The lack of natural snow isn't a big issue, but losing the snow they've made has been. When we go on our own and make the snow, we can do very well as long as Mother Nature doesn't keep taking it away from us. Either way, any day on the mountain is a good day. This year, I don't want to say we've been lucky because we're lacking some snow here, but I'll say it. We're pretty lucky to be skiing in this warm weather, and I'm grateful for it. Because there's still plenty of time for old man winter to drop a mountain of snow on the slopes this year. In Middlefield, meteorologist Ryan Breton, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.